in your body, your fascial system connects everything. It connects all of your muscles. Now, to make this tangible and also give you an experience, I would like to focus on a myofascial sling on the back of your body that reaches from the underside of the foot and then goes over the calf, the back of the thigh, across the sacrum, up the spine, <laughs> over or along the neck and then over the head. It is connecting your toe flexors, your calf muscles, your hamstrings and your spine extensors. And in the movement we are going to do together, it's called a spine stretch, we will lengthen these muscles and then sense their connectedness. You can have your Toes relaxed, the legs extended, the spine elongated, and then start to roll down slowly. Nodding first and then curling the spine. So you are in flexion in your spine, bringing the top of your head as close as you feel comfortable to your knees. So chances are you have some sort of stretch perception somewhere in that line I just pointed out. Just notice where it is and how strong it feels. And then from here you can flex your feet and see, did it change? Is it stronger or is it in a different place? Relax the toes, point, plantar flexion. How is it now? And then go again. Flex and feel how the stretch perception changes and if the location changes where you feel the stretch. Is it the sole of the foot? Is the stretch in your calves, the back of the knee? Is it in the hamstrings, the lower back, the mid back, maybe up in your neck? And then you can relax the toes and curl up. It could be anywhere. The muscles are connected with fascia and whatever, whatever body composition you have, we will feel the stretch differently. For me, it was very strong in the sole of my feet, but maybe for you, it was in the lower back, it was in the neck. So we were experiencing or we were doing the same kind of lengthening movement or stretching movement here, but the experience chances are was different and what we all experienced was the connectedness of the body the connectedness of muscles through the fascial system and then how we feel about it is very unique if you would like to know more about functional anatomy you can join me in the online course anatomy 201 at yogajournal.com <laughs>